The next most common uh, proton procedure is the PTT. And once again, we have to put our pipette on the pipetter that delivers the reagents and we have to set the dial this time to two. For the pro time, we had to set it to four. So just remember, follow your instructions before you, each, you do each procedure. Then you're gonna draw up the calcium chloride and set it in the well again. You're gonna put cuvette into well A, and once again today, we're just gonna do two normal and two abnormal controls. The patients would be run the exact same way. You could do a cuvette and put patient one and two of them, patient two and two of them. So you need your 50 microliter pipette again on the yellow pipette. This time, we it requires two reagents. The PTT reagent has an activator that mimics the collagen in your body. And it also has a phospholipid or platelet source. Since you use platelet poor plasma, this reagent provides both of those. Then you'll want to change your pipette tip and you're going to add two wells of normal control and once again remember you don't have to change tips and deliver it at the top so it doesn't mix with the reagent already in there to contaminate your tip. Change tips before you do your abnormal control and once again remember you always want to mix your reagents if they've sat at any time and I always rim mine as I come out. Some people use Kim wipes to wipe it off. Each site may do it a little bit different. You start your timer once again, and I always mix my cuvette a little bit. 